Hey guys, welcome to Coding Simplified. And today our problem is that given a binary tree, we need to print all the values at a given level. So if this is a binary tree, so for example, this is level one. So if you are given level, then we need to print two. If you are given level two, means this one, then we need to print seven and five. And suppose if you have given level three, then two, six, nine, and level four, five, eleven, and four. And if there is level where node doesn't exist, then you need you need not to print anything. So uh, what will be our logic? So what we will do? Will recursively will start from the root, and whenever will and will say that whenever level equals to one, then print that value. Else decrease the value by minus one, and do this for node of left and node of right. Right. So like this is my uh, function. So I am saying if node equals to null, it means return. We don't print anything. But if level equal to one, then you need to print node of data, and then you can return. Similarly, now you will go with node of left, and again you will decrease level minus one. So what will be the benefit? Let's say if you want to print value at level two. So what it will do? It will start from level two. So it want to go here. Now. It will go here in node of left and level minus one. So when it will recursively call, so it will come here seven and level will be one. So now it will print the value. So it will return and now it will go to right and then again it will print the value. So I will show you by an example. So here I have print at level function and I am passing root and I am passing. So let's say start from the level one. So let's start debug. And null node is not null, so now level is one, so it will print two, which is my level one, and it will simply return. But now let's say if you have level two, so what it will do? It will start from here and uh, it will go here. It will check that level is not one; it's two. It will go in node of left, so now node is seven, and level is one. So now it will go here and it will print the value. Now it will go in node of right, which is five in this case, and level is one because we have decreased the level by minus one. So now it will say, okay, I will print five, and it will return, and that's it, right? So now let's another example of four. So let's say I want to print level at level four, which is five, eleven, and four. So if you run the program. It will successfully print the values five, eleven, and four, right? So that's it, guys. Uh, we have seen uh, how to print all the values at given level, and the complexity of problem is big of n because uh, we are basically traversing the node at least once, right? So the complexity is big of n, and uh, in next tutorials we'll see some more problems on binary tree. And if you have liked the video then please like it and subscribe the channel for more such videos thank you